Yoruba land, not for Fulanese. If you attack, attack back. The book of Hosea chapter 4 verse 6 says, My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. That thou shalt be no priest to me. Say thou hast forgotten the love that God, I will also forget thy children. Yoruba youth, it is time for you to wake up, to form a formidable group within your localities, and be ready at any time to defend yourself from Fulanese and total Islamization of Nigeria and make Odudu a republic a reality. Yorubas, how long are you going to remain dumb to believe lies of pastors and governors and cabals and coward others? Pastor Yunok Adeboye was the booster of RCCG and not founder. He was the man that the real Christianity in Nigeria, especially Yoruba land. I am not judging, but he created classical modern Christians in RCCG that made many people to fall to the trap of Satan through fornications. He commercialized cook churches and deviated from the words of Bible entirely to make most believers Become more ritualist. Pa Adeboye lied to gullible Christians that they will not get to heaven because of tithes that made most of pastors become ritualists today that made Nigeria a bloody nation. I'm imploring all Yorubas not to believe any prophecies this year from Pastor Adeboye of RCCG to the Bakari of Letarin. Prophet Josiah Onoha Shukuma and Reverend Umbaka because they are working for Kabas ruling as Buhari in kingdom listing to whatever the Bible says about them. Second Corinthians chapter 11 verse 30 to 15 For such are first apostles, deceitful workers, transforming themselves into the apostle of Christ. And no marvel, for Satan himself is transformed into an angel of light. Therefore, it is no great thing if these ministers also be transformed as the minister of righteousness, most whose end shall be according to their works. I am not criticizing anyone, but I am imploring you rubbish that Odudu a republic is a bust. And no retreat, no surrender. Matthew Luther King Jr. said, and I quote, Nothing in the entire world is more dangerous than sincere ignorance and conscientious stupidity. If any Igbos or Yoruba elders believe that presidential Sony is coming to them in 2023, they must be greatest joker and fool of the year. Igbo elders support Biafra now and Yoruba support Odudua Republic now. Yoruba elders and offensive groups should stand by their demand Odudua Republic now or never. Buhari is using delay tactics to allow Fulanese from Chad, Mali, Burkina Faso and other African countries to conquer Yoruba land. Kayo defy me and not your credit to do a kitty and on those state governors and to be watched closely in Yoruba land. They are working against actualization of Odudua Republic. They are sons of Buhari. Yoruba should not believe in a motorcycle force announced by Payemi when he saw the reaction of Yoruba recently. A motorcycle police, why did federal government oppose state police raised by Yemi Oshibaju? Now they know that Yorubas are waking up from their slumber to tackle Fulanese. They are now organizing a Motekun program. A Motekun program is a fake. Fulanese from different countries are still trooping to Nigeria. Akre Dulu allowed 200 ex-men fully armed to settle at Ajawa Akoko to launch attack on Ondo State at any time and fire me allowed Fulani to take over on a kitty farm settlement now saying that there is a multiple program yorubas rise up now and fight for your land fight for your children 
Fight for your brothers. Fight for your unborn generation before it is too late. This is from your stupidity, gluttonous and selfishness, greediness and love of money. First Timothy chapter 6 verse 10. For the love of money is the root of all evil, which while some converted after, they have erred from the faith and pierced themselves through with many arrows. Those that were given 7,000 naira and 4,000 naira then, during election, are they not in great sorrow now? No one can worship God and money. The book of Luke chapter 16 verse 13 says, No servant can serve two masters, for either he will hate the one and love the other, or else he will love the one and despise the other. He cannot serve God and mammon. Oh, the Dua Republic is a must. No amount of threats or money offered should derail our Odudua agitation. This time around, the man in Aso Rock will destroy Nigeria soon. Have you listened to the leader of the terrorist group of Hesmen, Metiala, equating his group to Afeniferi, even he boastfully said no Fulani in the whole world needs visa to Nigeria. So this is the time for Yoruba to wake up from their slumber. Yoruba Dej says, Instead for lions to become the treasurer of tigers, each will hunt their game separately. There is no nation called Nigeria anymore. Biafra will soon be actualized in Jesus' name, no matter any obstacles. O to do a republic, let us use the opportunity of Apple led by Mars in Namdekano to liberate our kingdom from Fulanis. Baba Basojo, I heard that you want God to be pleased with you. It will be a great achievement for you, sir, if you do a republic is actualized during your lifetime. Please stop romancing with greedy Igbo elders and the Arewas that are against Biafra Nation and Odudua Republic. If it's because of your investment in the North, prepare to arrange to pay them foreign tax. Once again, all elders in Nigeria knows that money in Asu Rock is not Buhari, and it pained me to the marrow of my bone that Aisha Buhari, the wife of late General Muhammad Buhari connived with the elders of the north and sinned against God and against Nigeria as a whole to deprive her husband, state defeated Beria, as the leader of Nigeria who died January 27, 2017 in London, United Kingdom, and was buried in foreign land, Saudi Arabia. What a great shame, Aisha Buari. You brought to your family, especially your daughter and son, who graduated recently, that they can never point to the grave of their father in the nation that their father sat for many years. Your operation and your cooperation with Kabas will serve as a guilty conscience to you till you enter your grave. The looted money you saved in foreign land cannot save you from your calamity of lies that entangles you. John 8, 32 to 35. And you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. They answered him, and Abraham's descendants have never been in bondage to anyone. How can you say you'll be made free? Jesus answered, Most assuredly, I say to you, whoever commits sin is a slave of sin, and a slave does not abide in the house forever, but son abides forever. If you repent, Lord is able to forgive you and confirm the truth to the whole nation. In Namdekano, I pulled leader was right about his findings in Aso Rock, Okorosha, Oshiomole, Galadima, Dajuma, Obasanjo, just few. They all knows what we knew. 
Yoruba people should be aware that no more rule of law in Nigeria. Nigeria is disintegrated nations where all states should make the law that pleases them and protect their citizens now. If 12 states in northern Nigeria should adopt Sharia law without following the constitution, that means that Biafrans and Oduduas and Niger Delta should do what pleases their citizens and to protect their citizens. Nigeria, an abode for terrorists, bandits, hesmen, remnants of ISIS, ISWAP, and terrorism, should be on watch list of United Nations and United States of America and State of Israel constantly. Contrary to Femi Adeshino or Presidency, that America should not interfere to Nigeria affairs. There is no more a country called Nigeria. We have disintegrated Nigeria. On behalf of Odudu and Republic, I'm imploring President Donald Trump. Oh,